We knew a woman would win the 16th edition of Survivor, but we didn't know which one until the final moments last night. And joining us now is the person who won Survivor, the sole survivor, Parvati Shallow. Parvati, thanks for joining us today. Thank you. Hey, to start off with, congratulations. Thank you, Joe. What did you think was the key to your victory? Um, I think there were a lot of things that went into it, but I think honestly the making the women's alliance was a huge turning point in the game and I mean the, the women that I pulled together were brilliant strategists and everyone knew what they were doing and we were able to pull off some major blindsides and make a crazy season. <laughs> it was a very crazy <laughs> season. Which was harder for you though, this season or Cook Islands? This season was hands down and like hands down a thousand times more difficult than Cook Islands. And I was just playing so much harder. I was playing to win this game and I wasn't going to let anything stop me basically. So um, yeah, it was it was difficult for me mentally, physically it was more draining. It was a, it was a tougher island, it was tougher conditions and it wore me out. I'll be honest here. Did any of the fans really have a chance against the veterans of the game? You know what? I thought they would in the beginning, just because we didn't know them, we didn't know who they were, you know, I thought they had an advantage in that way. But as the game progressed, I realized, wow, the favorites have a huge leg up over the fans because we know what we're doing. You know, we had all the experience under our belts and, and the fans honestly didn't stand a chance. Yeah, been there and done that, and there yeah. were a lot of stupid moves this season. Oh my Aside God. from Eric's <laughs> massive blunder, what do you think was the next dumbest move this season? Jason. Jason with the idol. I mean, he just, like, two days before saw his, his favorite, his hero, get voted out with the idol in his back pocket, and Jason trusted the girls who, who pulled that on their friend and didn't play the idol, and he had the idol in his pocket, and he... I mean, yes, Jason was number two dumbest move <laughs> in the game this time. And I think he knows it, too. I think he does, too. Now, personally, I'd, I'd love to see a winner's edition of Survivor with you and Richard Hatch, Tina Wesson, Vesepia, Amber, I all the others right competing. I right now, that is never going to happen. <laughs> so you wouldn't do that if that was a, an option? I will not go back on that island ever. <laughs> <laughs> For a third that time. If you paid me another million dollars, I wouldn't do it. Hey, final question. You just okay. won one million dollars. What are your plans? Oh, everyone keeps asking me that question tonight. Um, <laughs> I really want to help build up this charity that I've been working for, the boxing charity. It's called Knockouts for Girls, and we provide boxing training and, and college scholarships for underprivileged girls. That sounds pretty neat. Well, Poverty, once again, congratulations. You played the game well, and we wish you the best. Thank you.